body is saying not cute. Body is saying not a hippie. See, I know the secret sign. The secret sign. Hello once again and welcome to Dialectics with Bruce. Petka. Now, <coughs> as I was saying, <coughs> as the focus of intellectual pursuits at the university in the late 60s, early 70s turned to socialism, many uh, prominent professors were fired and the study of socialism dialectics moved, in, moved into the street. So that's why as well as what I said about spiritual studies also being forced to move to the street as they were closed down. Uh, many of the professors of course have since moved back into the ivory halls of learning whereas many people like me are left on the street and yet we were at the forefront of the, the university and the movements in education at the time. Now, uh, <coughs> dialectics has to do with questioning reality, which uh, bourgeois syllogistic thought, that is very simple Greek thought, that A equals A, but A does not in fact equal A, because the second A is in a different place in time. Now, so you do have the right to question reality. Things are not self-identical. And in fact, you must question reality. You must add not just a passive consciousness to what you see as reality. You must add your questioning consciousness to reality, to so-called negate it, that is to change it. You add yourself to whatever you're looking at, it changes. Now, uh, where am I getting at? By doing this, you minimize contradictions. But capitalism is based on contradictions. It is true. Even Hegel said, contradictions is what holds it all together. However, it also splits things apart, of course. Male, female, for instance, you're trying.